Every day, humans require millions of kilowatts of electricity and heat energy. Today, natural gas is the most economically viable and environmentally friendly energy source available. Gazprom is the largest natural gas recovery and delivery company. Gazprom owns the world's largest explored gas reserves, 36 trillion cubic meters. That amounts to 17% of the world's total reserves. Every year, Gazprom is capable of recovering over half a trillion cubic meters of gas. The company is developing fields from the Barents Sea in the west to the Sea of Okhotsk in the east. Very soon, almost a third of all recovered gas will come from a newly developed field on the Yamal Peninsula. It's named Yekaterina and is a super-modern domestic drilling rig. A powerful spinning wrench connects the drill pipes one after another, meter after meter, as they dig deep into the Bavaninkovskaya field, the peninsula's largest gas deposit. The gas recovered at this field beyond the polar circle travels many thousands of kilometers to reach a power plant or to become the blue flame in your kitchen stove. The Russian Unified Pipeline System stretches over 170,000 kilometers, and every day, Gazprom is extending this grid. To shorten routes, pipes are laid not just on land, but also on the seafloor. For instance, Nord Stream is the shortest route for Russian gas to Western Europe. For over 30 years, Gazprom has been a reliable gas supplier to the countries of Europe. Currently, it delivers gas to nearly every European country. Our entrance into more large-scale markets is ahead. The power of the Siberia gas pipeline will connect the Kovaktinskoye field in Yarkutsk region with the Chayandinskoye field in Yakutia. The pipe will stretch further, more than 2,000 kilometers across the wild taiga to the Amur region and the Chinese border. China is one of the most promising markets for the company's pipeline-delivered gas. It is truly the Silk Road of the 21st century. But there are drastically different ways of transporting gas. All natural gas is cooled down to minus 170 degrees. It turns into a liquid, while its volume is reduced by a factor of 600. This property of gas, which is liquefied at Russia's first plant on Sakhalin Island, has enabled the company to reach new customers. Liquid gas does not need pipes. Gazprom's LNG tankers can deliver the product to any destination. So, the company supplies its largest gas volumes to the domestic market and covers two-thirds of all demand. Gazprom delivers natural gas to hundreds of power plants and industrial companies, thousands of heating stations and millions of Russian apartments and cottages. It brings light and heat to the citizens of Russia.